All right, fellas, wanted to get with you with this screen drill. Um, had a chance to do it at practice. Of course, as always, it's, it wasn't in its perfect state with a, with a ton of kids. So um, I wanted to show you just like I did before, um, the best case scenario state uh, when you do have enough kids. And then, um, and then when from there, I'll show you what actually we did and, and then show it to you on a quick little film of it, okay? Um, so probably most of you have heard of the screen drill. Some people call it an orbit drill, um, but uh, we use orbit for an, <laughs> for one of our motions, so I don't like to confuse the kids. So I just call it a screen drill. Keep it simple. Um, so in a perfect world, um, we have two groups facing each other, probably 15 yards or so apart. So we have a group here, the quarterback, and then you know maybe if you have two quarterbacks or three quarterbacks, have them ready to go. Um, we'll have our Ys out here split out like it's an open and our Rs out here just like it's an open and they their alignment is just like it always is. Um, and we'll start out by just having um, these Rs running their now footwork and then Y practicing coming down the line hard to block um, and get up on the most dangerous man, okay? Um, we'll have, you know, a line of Rs back here and a line of Ys back here and then quickly we will, you know, after after the first rep, next one's up, and, and we'll keep it going. Um, the quarterbacks are practicing, um, of course, their technique, right? They're, they're practicing um, flipping their hips and getting the ball out as quickly as possible. We don't care if they get on the laces or not. The point is to get the ball out quick. Um, and this is full speed, by the way. So we have a quarterback here throwing this. Um, now screens, and we'll talk a little bit in a second here. Um, about the one here and then we have the quarterback on this side with the F's and L's um, Throwing the pedal screen and then L's practicing blocking the most dangerous man. Okay um, Now we do definitely uh, Want to start introducing How we're gonna call on the fly the difference between a, a pedal and a now screen because we will call it on the fly and last year we actually had you know, our, our, our pedal screens were Larry and Roger and our now screens, we just called now screens. But I, I heard, I can't remember where I heard it from, uh, probably Salas or somebody like that. Um, basically, since since the blocking is the same up on with, with the big guys up front with now and pedal screens, and mostly it's just um, there. there's no blocking getting to the edge because this is happening so fast. It's more of like receivers blocking for each other. Um they didn't differentiate the two. They basically put numbers behind it. Um, so the outside receiver would be number one. So I, you could say Roger one or Roger would just be the typical um, Y turns into the back pedal. Uh, out here, we'd say Larry one if we want him to do the now screen and then him block the most dangerous. Um, or we just say Larry and he would do the pedal screen and he would block the most dangerous. And so we start, as we get better at this, we'll start calling it out before each rep, just quickly, Larry one or Larry or Roger one or, or Roger. Now we do practice this with three receivers as well. Um, and we actually have started to layer in um, the two. Um, so now this turns into Roger one or Roger two, or just plain old Roger. Um, you could label this three, but I think just calling it Roger just solidifies that that's the that's the normal, typical with a three by one. We're we're probably going to throw a Roger to this guy to a, a, a pedal screen. So these two guys, when their numbers are called, they're always pedal screens. Obviously, if it's a Roger two, F is going to get to the most dangerous man um, and block him. You know, I'm sure you wouldn't call it unless there was a re real specific reason you want to get him the ball, and usually it's the alignment or something. Um, so anyway, so before the snap, we're yelling out Roger 1, Roger 2, or just plain old Roger, and they need to get used to doing it on the fly because we're going to do this on the fly, okay? Same thing here. Um, they can work on their alignment with this, but again, we go Larry 1. He does the now screen. Uh, Larry 2. Y does the back pedal now, and F blocks the most dangerous, or just Larry is just F doing his typical um, bubble, okay? So hopefully that makes sense. Let me know if you have any questions in the chat below on that. Um, I want to show the film now so you guys can get a sense of what I'm talking about. We only had a handful of kids, obviously, in the current state of things. 
Uh, we didn't even have enough to go um, two sided today. So, so basically, what you're about to watch here in a second is just one group going. We're trying to get tempo. We're trying to get you know the quarterbacks working their steps and, and these guys getting used to the terminology and doing their steps and and correcting. You know, these guys always want to come in too far, and these guys don't want to fire out initially and, and then start to backpedal. And these quarterbacks still want to you know take a lazy drop or a, 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 not a quick. You know, there's even even a one step drop is too much for screens. We want them flipping their hips. Uh, if they get good enough, they can flip them while the ball's in the air and get the ball out. They don't need to be on the laces. Uh, anyway, watch the drill, and we'll be right back to close out. Larry one, Larry one. Work your feet, quarterback. Get the ball out. Larry one. Get the ball out. Down. Set, go. Good. Way to get it out. Perfect. Let's go, Larry. Larry. Down. Set, go. Turn upfield. There's no reason to turn backwards like that. Upfield, Larry. That's the perfect ball. F, you need to, first step needs to be harder. Larry. Down, set, go. Good, good, Jack, good, oh! Good footwork, at least, next. Larry won, Larry won. Down, set, go. Larry won. Good. Lead him upfield, quarterbacks. Lead him upfield. Larry won. Lead him upfield just a little bit. It's too far in. Who is that out there? Fitzgerald? Hey, you got You can't come that far in. All the bad guys are in here. Larry won. Aaron. Go, Larry. Larry. Down. Never mind. Come here. Yeah, well, I just wanted you there earlier so he could have made the audible. But if he's two on two, we haven't taught Ty on this, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, I got you. I got you. Larry. Larry. Down. Go. Good. Way to get it out. We don't need the ball perfect on that one. Just get the ball out. Larry won. Larry won. You, you, you. Down. Set. Go. Nice. Great job. Great. All right. Awesome. Hopefully you enjoyed that. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. If you uh, want to see other drills, let me know in the comments below. And please, as always, like. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. It is how we know. Um, we are putting out the right information. So please do all those things and continue to share like you have been with other coaches. All right, guys. Hope you like this one. Talk to you soon.